Yeah. <laughs> what up? Welcome back to another video. So today I have had a lot of requests, a lot of questions. As soon as this hit the internet all over the place, I had a ton of messages in my inbox in my Instagram. So if you're not following my Instagram, follow me on my Instagram. It's the same name as my YouTube, MarvelKid87. But anyways, um, everyone wanted my take on what I thought on this new El Diablo. So we get the 2022 Lowrider S. It's not, they're not calling it the Lowrider ST. They're just calling it the Lowrider... S. S. El Diablo. It looks amazing. So right before we dive into what I think about it and everything else, let's talk about what we know about the Icon, right? So Icon is something that Harley Davidson started doing last year. They spoke about coming out with these new Icon Edition, special edition bikes. Last year for 2021, we had the uh, revival, the Electric Glide in white and blue. That thing was super, super cool. So it, it paid homage to the old, old Electric Glide, um, what, later became the street glide and everything else so pretty cool um and then for this year they wanted to pay homage to the fxrt um super popular bike uh, i mean this bike from what i know for what i keep hearing back in the day you couldn't give these fairings away now people are just mocking up uh these fxrt fairings fxrp fairings on on dinas and road kings and soft hills and everything Super, super cool. So from what it looks like, this year we're paying homage to the 1983 FXRT. That bike is beautiful. Um, so we got a similar color as you can see right here in the picture. Um, they, they did a really good job, man. Now, like I was saying, what Harley Davidson is doing here is paying homage to an old bike, making it somewhat modern, giving you that old school taste, but modernized, right? So we're just gonna modernize an old bike bring that nostalgic back that's their main purpose with this whole series right so do not expect a, a crazy 131 in it do not expect a whole bunch of features that are not on the regular base bikes it's not for that it's just to pay homage to the old bikes the old goodies and this is what they did with this bike i think they did an amazing job i think the paint job looks super super clean really nice um and then what they also added on to this one is the rock for fosgate um audio system that you can put into the uh, 2022 Lowrider ST. Um, so that comes equipped on this bike. So really the big differences you're gonna see on this bike compared to let's say just a Lowrider ST, it's just a sick paint job and the audio, That that's it. Besides that, it's the same exact bike. But that paint job, man, they, they did really, really good. Even with the emblem on the tank, I love the little devil's little tail hanging out like it's, it's super super cool i love that logo i love how they really put that together it looks really really cool now a few months ago i wanted to make this video because i did do some research and i did see that uh harley davidson had reserved this name i think it was even last year so they did reserve the el diablo name and and there, there was a few stuff on there that you could kind of tell that they were kind of heading this direction i wanted to do that video but then i just didn't um but it's it's a nice surprise to see it this year i thought they might have been pushing it for 2023 Bryce, what, what do you think about this bike right here put it up what do you think about that Bro, that is so super cool that's what that's cool super cool super cool you like that i want a motorcycle you want what I want a green motorcycle. You want a green motorcycle? Yeah. Okay, no, we'll work on that. Okay. It's my kid. <laughs> now let's talk about the big elephant in the room because I'm pretty sure you guys are wondering, well, if, if all we're getting is a paint job and the audio, like, what's this costing us? So we're looking at $27,999. So a lot more money than the Lowrider ST. Um, and I mean, you're basically paying for a paint job. And this is also a numbered bike. So this is gonna be one out of 1,500 for the whole entire world. So 1,500 of these bikes are being made for the whole entire world. That's um, it's not, it's not a crazy amount. That's the reason why you're paying more money for this. I'm pretty sure they're gonna sell out instantly as soon as, soon as they come in because that 
paint job looks uh, amazing. But you guys tell me down below, would you rather just save a few bucks and just get the regular Lowrider ST or pay a lot more money for this, being that it's a series bike, it's an icon bike, it's paying homage to something that made what the Lowrider ST is today. What do you think down below? What do you think about the paint job? Do you think they should have made, added more parts to it? Because, I mean, for that price point, you, you, you're probably like, well, they should have, you know, done a bigger engine. They should have changed a few things around and added more stuff. Um, but like I said, this is not to make a crazy performance bike. This is only to pay homage to what has made the Lowrider ST today. The Lowrider ST. Are we done? Almost. Why? You want to be done already? You want to go on the trampoline? Okay. Time for the trampoline. Um, yeah. Little guy here came to help me out. Um, that's gonna be it guys. Just wanted to give you my take on it. I think it's an awesome move what Harley Davidson is doing with this whole Icon Edition. Um, I saw Blackhead's video this morning and I was like, I was blown away. So huge shout out to Blackhead out there doing his thing. And guess what? I got some more big news on my Lowrider S, my 2020 Lowrider S. So a lot more stuff happening tomorrow with that bike. So tune in for those videos, more updates and um, more stuff happening with the Road Glide. And some a few events coming up soon, so tune in for those videos. So if you're new to my channel, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell button. That's gonna notify you anytime I upload any type of new content. And like always, let the force be with you. Ride safe and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace. Peace. Yeah. yeah.